gonna power possess this guy just to do the lightning. You know what we could do? If we really want to be lame. Might be our only win condition, guys. What is going on, YouTube? Welcome back to another Sohinky Channel video, where today, uh, what I'm going to show you is a game from the other day on my stream. So someone challenged us to make the worst Elagos build we could possibly make. This is not that build. This is actually a decent build. Uh, but they challenged me to make the worst Elagos build I could possibly make and then try and win with it. And basically what we came up with was most of our points were invested in uh, possessing survivors, which if you're following this game at all is not really a viable win condition for the game. Uh, the rest of the points went into just basically the most useless stuff uh, that we could possibly find. Um, and uh, there, there isn't like a lot, so I was trying to explain this, there isn't really a ton that's terrible uh, to buff because all the talents are improvements for the character on a base level, but we just, just picked the worst talents we could find and then invest most of our points in possessing survivors. So. Uh, that's basically what we did. We'll see how the game goes. One last thing I want to mention, uh, myself, Mari Jovenshire, and Lasercorn started a new channel yesterday, so you should definitely check that out. I'll put a link in the description. Uh, it's a podcast, but we're also planning on potentially having some gaming stuff, uh, on there as well, so be sure to check out the new channel. Other than that, guys, enjoy the game. Not only... Oh, dude, it's way worse than 87%. I think it's like 99% bad. Um... Not only do we have all the stuff that is required, not only do we have all the stuff rather that is uh, buffing, possessing the players, but we have nothing that increases their fear. So we're almost never gonna be able to do it. It's like literally the worst possible build I could come up with. And then we're gonna buff possession up all the way first. That's like the first thing we're gonna buff. And then we gotta get Duker's Necromancer after this one. We are those that dwell in the dark. Alright, this is amazing. So we just circle down this way. Our time has come to claim their world. I'm gonna go in the tunnel, I think, and get the crates here. Just because we're here. We'll go out the middle and check Nobi afterward. Wait, we're good. Yeah, I mean it. It's just not a viable win condition, though, because good survivors will just unpossess you almost instantly. That's why I'm saying it's not a viable win condition. It's not that possessing the survivors isn't a good strategy, it's that it doesn't really, like, close the game out the way other things do. That's all. Lag tunnel. The laggiest tunnel. Always lag in the tunnel. Oh, and here they are. Amazing. Look at that. Luck is on our side. Uh, possession, basic. Don't worry, we're gonna max possession. I'm allowed to, like, still try to win, right? What a libation! Oh, we got all three of them, dude. That's actually insane. Damn, we buffed the explosion. That hit him pretty hard, I think. Possession. Basic. Maybe I should be buffing energy. What am I doing? Shouldn't be buffing uh, basics anymore, I don't think. Hit me with the car. The car's broken now, I think. This guy's kind of going up ahead on his own a little bit. 
I don't mind. Yeah, we'll do energy. We gotta get to this crate before he does. Make sure he that happens like this. Stop taunting! That's actually a phenomenal person to get that on them. Getting the evil ashes on her. Alright, here we go. If you want to know why it's not good, I literally just had full energy. <laughs> I literally just had full energy, and all they did was mash attacks on me, and I get unpossessed. That's why this is not a win condition. So you literally can't do anything against uh, skilled survivors that, <laughs> if you possess them. Because they're just nut-hugging each other, and they unpossess you even with full energy literally instantly. Getting shockingly good damage? <laughs> I guess. I mean, I'm getting good damage because I'm just using the basics, how they're supposed to be used. Uh, let's just max energy still, honestly. We gotta find anyone that's, like, even remotely separate, but I don't, I don't think they are. They're all four here, so... I, I don't think they're ever gonna split. The strategy, it just doesn't work. But I'm fine to have a long game and lose and show you why it doesn't work because I feel like it's important for people to see. Stop taunting! Stop taunting! Okay, possession. Am I allowed to get my boss? You didn't specify if I'm, if I'm allowed to get my boss. I'm allowed to get it? Okay. Get this one, get this one. Damn you. She's off on her own. This is like the perfect time to strike. Yeah, relax. I wonder if that hits him. Doesn't look like it. Um, I guess we do boss here. Because that's our only chance of winning, really. Alright, I guess we gotta play this, like, uh... The old way. How would I rework possession if I could? I don't know. I think it's hard. I don't think it's meant to be a win condition, really. It's just meant to be a tool. I didn't... That's hilarious. <laughs> I got it in midair, so it flipped. It was really funny. Where'd they go? Wait, what the hell? Where are they? Oh, they're at the pages. Jesus. I guess we gotta put a value point in elites. I'm gonna power possess this guy just to do the lightning. You know what we could do? If we really want to be lame. This might be our only win condition, guys.
All right, Elagos time. Oh wait, I don't have the bleed. I forgot I didn't have the bleed. Oh, this character's useless without the bleed, dude. Got him, dude. <laughs> We had to cheese him, dude. We had to. I would have lost without the cheese. <laughs> I would have lost without the cheese, dude. I had to do it. Please forgive me, chat. <laughs> I just didn't see any other route to victory. <laughs> Impressive. Thank you. 